Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Nicole. Um, I changed the name of my channel. Um, I am changed it to uh, Crazy Beautiful Nicole, Journey of a Reseller. reseller. Uh, my store name on eBay is Crazy Beautiful Nicole. Um, so I thought I would match it to my YouTube channel and then also kind of put what it's about. So Journey of a Reseller. Um, so I'm back today with another box from a different place. Um, this box today is from Bulk. So I'm excited. I have been, um, I am a reseller on platforms like eBay and Macari. And um, it has been going absolutely amazing. So I have needed inventory to stock my, my store. I don't have the option to go to thrift stores as much as I would love to. I don't have that option. So um, I need to, I needed to source from different places to get um, inventory. So I've been going to Wholesale Ninjas and Restock. Um, and now I'm trying bulk. So um, I got the bulk idea from Hooked on Pickin'. Um, she had a... Um, like a PDF file that you could buy off her store that you could buy and she sends you instantly to your email a list of, you know, all the plate, all the sources that she uses to get her inventory with their current coupon codes. So bulk was one of the places on there. And plus I've been watching a ton of videos of people opening bulk boxes. So I went on their website and, um, so I don't really have, I can't really get the palettes yet. I don't have the room for it. Like, um, and I'm, I'm new at this, so I want to make sure I'm doing the right thing. So I've been looking at their case lots. Well, um, I guess, um, I started looking and I don't know, there was, I just, I decided to, you know, kind of wait and look. And, um, I saw that on Hooked on Picking, uh, Picking, that she said that, Bulk also sells on eBay. And I was like, oh my gosh, really? So I went over to eBay and they actually do. They sell right on eBay. So I bought a bulk box, bulk box but I bought it from, on eBay. So I bought this box on <clears throat> January 9th and I paid a total of $84.14. Um, it arrived today. And um, the box was actually $47.91 plus $30 shipping. So there's a different kinds of boxes on there. Now, the cool thing about these boxes is they are not mystery boxes. Um, these are unexpected returns and it was manifested. So I could actually see exactly what was in this box. So I just wanted to show you guys um, in case you're interested. They didn't really have too much of a stock photo. Like this is the photo. This phone, I'm sorry, I'm waiting for my other phone to come in the mail. So this is the photo that was in the, uh, oh my gosh, my son's light. Like, let me turn that off. There, there we go. That was the problem. So this is the stock photo, okay? Now, it said that the reason I got this lot is because the va the original retail value is pretty high. So $547 and um, 84 cents was the, um, there. That's not gonna work. Okay, so that's not gonna work. So, um, 87, um, sorry. It was five, the retail value of the box was $547.84, says Madison Park and Gel Pro. Now, when you go down to the item description, you can click on it and it actually will show you everything that's in the box. Like, it's really, really neat. Um, I guess I'm, I guess it's not gonna, my phone is not gonna, I guess you can kind of see a little bit of it. I'm not sure why 
my phone is not showing so showing you guys but um there we go i had to put it in front of the eyepiece <laughs> so there we go there's the eyepiece So, if I could get this here, there. So, here's the manifest, okay? So, see how it'll show me, like, everything that's in there. It'll show me where it's from, and it'll show me um, the retail price, how many it is. So, the reason why I got this lot is because um, I kind of looked up everything, and it seemed like a pretty decent box. I only paid $87, um, $87 for it, and... There are, there is like some, um, like a cl atomic clock in there that's valued at $40. I looked them up on eBay. They're selling for about 30. Um, and there's a lot of curtains. Okay. Now really expensive curtains. So I kind of looked up on eBay and curtains are selling. Um, there's also a few little things that, I don't know. I just kind of wanted something different. Plus I wanted to get one of their boxes and see what it was all about. I want to see if, um, see if I see if I liked it like the uninspected return see see how it goes so that way I know if I want to go bigger um I'm currently going through I've almost been selling on eBay for three months I started October 17th um I know my my sales is at about almost 7,000 obviously that's not what I made but my sales are about I've sold about 340 items <laughs> and the sales are at about 6,800. Um, 6, so soon I'm going to be going, I'm going to be making videos about these boxes that I have, I have shown on here. I'm going to be coming back and showing, telling you guys like here, this is exactly what sold, um, how much I made, how much is left. So I'm going to be doing that with each individual box. So I can, I can see too, like, am I making profit from these things? Um, the Wholesale Ninjas box that I got the other day, um, I didn't think it was that great when I was opening it. But as I started going through it, listing it, like two covers, two grill covers in there the other day, um, they, their retail value was $71 a piece and they're selling on eBay for like $60. So I was like, wow, just two things from that box, you know, is over half of what I paid for it. So um, I just, I wanted to do something different. This is... um. Not a mystery, but I the the mystery is within how um the the uh like how the item is going to be because these are unexpected returns. Is there going to be something wrong? I've watched a few videos lately where um people um have actually gotten like you know pretty much broken stuff. So let's see if it's worth it. Let's dig in here, guys. This is bulk. Bought from eBay. All right. Let's dig in the box and see if there's anything that's going to make me some money. All right. Here we go. Here we go. This is what it looks like. Looks pretty good so far, y'all. All right. So first things first, I'm going to take these curtains out. They are heavy. So that's open. Okay. These are beautiful curtains. Um, they say that the value of these curtains is about $59 a piece. So the good thing is I got two of them. Oh, so they're matching. These are really heavy, so they would be a lot to ship, but these are really nice. Um, as I'm doing this, I wanted to tell you the value that they say these are. So these are Design Solution Total Blackout Curtains Quinn top panels um and they're huge they're 100 188 180 inches in length they're total blackout so there's two of those um let's see what i they say that the value of those is 59 dollars and 99 cents for one so i did look those up and that is correct it does show though i think they show those at bath and body works but the good thing about these is you can scan them too. So um, I'm just gonna do one really quick. I wanna see if, you know, it brings them up. You can scan. Beep. 
Oh, no matches. So, let's see, design solutions. Total blackout. Win. 108. Okay, so I do see that people are selling these. Looks for about, mm, let's see how much they've sold for. So I figured that I'd definitely make my money back from the box. Um, six results. So it looks like right here, one just sold a few days ago, total blackout curtains. Um, the same exact one, just in a different color for $30 with, with free shipping. So, um, $40 free shipping. So I'll have to, you know, do some, do some leg work with these and, um, see what I'm going to put them on there for. Um, they look like, you know, they're, they're in good condition. The only thing that stinks about these is they're because there's their customer returns. So like, hopefully there's nothing wrong with these. Um, I might have to pull them out and look just so I can make sure that there's no stains or anything like that. All right, the next thing you guys, boy, I need to sit. I'm getting older, my knees are starting to hurt. So this is the Accurite Atomic Clock. And that's one of the reasons I got this box too is because these are selling on eBay. Um, I saw that, you know, there is a few sold within the last few days, so. Um, Right there, people are listing those for um, anywhere from, well, about, about thir between 30 and $50, but then you have to actually see if it's sold. So show three results. Okay, one just sold, a few sold in December, one for 20 plus shipping, one for 30 plus shipping, and then one for best offer. So I figured, hey, you know, like um, getting $20 and, you know, that's, that's a quarter of the box. So, um, let me, let me go back into my purchases here and I'll tell you what they say that they're worth. So there, this is, there isn't a lot in this box, but I don't know. I thought the value of it was, like I said, I thought it was worth it to get the box. I guess we'll find out. I don't know how many people have actually buy curtains on um, eBay. But I will tell you this, since I have been selling on eBay, I have been purchasing from eBay. Like now that I know that, I, I didn't know before like people resold and that it was so big like it is. Now I always go to eBay for pretty much all my purchases. Like I really like knowing I'm giving my money to another reseller who is, you know, trying to make it in the world just like me. So I just bought some perfume from there. I just bought, I buy all my, like I buy my shipping supplies from there. Um, I even bought underwear from there the other day. <laughs> so um, since selling on eBay, I've been using that to purchase things as well. So I feel like other resellers do that too. Um, let's see. Um, sorry, here we go. Why can't I like do that? Okay. So the next thing is another curtain. This did have a lot of curtains in it. Um, I didn't mind. I want to see how curtains do. I want to have a variety in my store. So um, these are the, uh, these next curtains are the Wam, Wam, Wam Suda. Um, these ones say they're valued at $29.99. So um, there's another one. They're really nice curtains. That's just one panel though, one sheer. So... Um, it looks like it's, you know, in new condition. So next thing is, okay, here's the little shot glasses. Okay, so th these are um, little two ounce glasses. There's six in there. Um, they're from Luigi Ramori. And um, the retail value of these is $29.99. Now the cool thing about this is too, when I purchased this box, right? Within these few days, I was able to go ahead and look all this stuff up and create my listings. So my listings are ready to go with all this stuff 
that I have here. They're all in my drafts. So now today, all they have to do is um, list now, list now, list now. They're all ready. I've already created everything. So I thought that that was pretty cool too. Um, so these are the shock glass. Oh, there is one missing. See, that's something I can't list. I would have to say one missing. They're not all in here. Very nice glasses, but there is only five, y'all. Okay, so that brings down the value a little bit. I I cannot, I don't, I wouldn't use these. Um, I, I do not drink alcohol. All right, here's the next thing. Okay, so here, so this is not in the original packaging. Um, the Pony Dance Double Curtains. Uh, I don't even know, like, it's not in the original packaging. These are A Pony Dance. Hmm, I didn't see this on the manifest, so that kind of stinks. That stinks that it's not in the original packaging, so it definitely brings down the value. But the, uh, this is obviously a huge curtain. There's two pieces here. It's silver and gray. So it's kind of weird how they did that. It's kind of weird how they put the new stuff, like, on top of the box, but then everything else was below it. All right, let's see. That's why I didn't want to spend a lot of money on the first box. I, I just wanted to see how it went. All right, let's see. Come on. Okay. Where's the ponies? Oh, right here. Okay, this is the expensive curtain. Um. Oh, wow. This, the Katarina... Right here, it says it right on the side. Okay, so it does have the barcode right there. Um, Katarina, so they say that this is a $100 curtain. Um, let me see. Katarina layered solid blackout with sheer top curtain gray for one is $99. So $99 for this curtain, but I'm gonna have to take it out. I'm gonna have to inspect it. And obviously it brings down the value because it doesn't have the original packaging. So we'll see. Um, Next, here we go. Next, this is a uh, this is probably that there's like a um, a little um, oh, a candle in here that was valued at $14. Let's just go ahead and open it up. I need my scissors wherever I put them right there. Oh, okay. Sorry, this is taking a little bit. Okay, here we go. Oh my goodness. At least it still isn't going to break. I can't get in here. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, okay. So this is a candle. Um, oh, it smells wonderfully. Um, let's see. The problem is, is I think it's missing the top. Because on the manifest, it shows that, yep, it is. It's missing the top. This is supposed to be like a pineapple. Um, and it's supposed to have like a little top. <sighs> yeah, I don't know why I can't like show you guys anything. This is wicked annoying. <sighs> Do you see my cat in the background, you guys? Pretty baby. So it's actually supposed to have a top to it. It's supposed to have a, um, like a pineapple top to it. So um, that's, uh, I won't be able to sell this. I mean, I could sell it as is, but honestly, I'll just probably keep that. It wouldn't be worth it to ship it. It's heavy. So uh, somebody returned that without its top. I don't know why they would keep the top. All right, let's move on. Oh, next. Oh, there was a knife in there. Okay, so there was a, um, let's see, a, um, a signature steak knife, and this was valued at $24.99, and pretty baby, do you want to say hi 
to you two people. Come here. Come here, pretty baby. Oh, she won't come over. Okay. So here it is. This is not new. It's in its box still. Very nice. Okay, let's, how do I open this? Oh, I got to push it out again. Okay. Warning, warning. Activate your warranty, I mean. Seriously, why can't I get this out? I don't even know how to open this. Oh my God. Oh, so you have to open it. Oh, there we go. All right, so this is how it goes. This is brand new. Um, uh, looks like this. So it's just a one steak knife. Um, so, I mean, I could sell that. That's brand new, still in its box. And um, let's see. We'll see. Maybe I would sell it for probably maybe like $13 plus shipping. So what I try to do is see the value of stuff and then take money off. So it's worth it to shop with me and so I can help people save money. Um, that's how I do it. So the next thing is, oh, a brand new bath bed. It's still got the tags on it. This is really nice. Um, I know I always say this, but I think I might keep this. <laughs> I actually really like this. This is really like a heavy duty rug. It's really nice. I just got a brand new shower curtain. And it would go really beautiful with that. So um, this is from Wham Sada. I hope I'm saying this right. Wham Sada. It's a bath rug. Um, there's, I don't see any uh, price tag on it. But um, it's really nice. Heavy duty and white. Um, they valued that at, let's see. Um, they valued that at $24.99. So let's keep moving forward. Okay, right here. These are Jelly Pro Jelly Grippers double sided non slip gel pads. Oh, okay. So they just help stuff stay in place. Those are neat. Um, there's two packages of those on there. So um, they say that those are worth $9.99 a piece. Um, so nice. Okay, there is an issue. One of the packages is new, and it has four, like it's supposed to. The other pack only has two. So, a little bit of an issue there. Next is, oh, this is the Santa pack. Okay, so I was curious about this. It said it was like some type of Santa baggish thing, so let's check it out. Oh, interesting. Okay, so it's basically just like a bag. Merry Christmas, or what's that say? Merry and Bright. Oh my gosh, it has somebody's name on it. It says Yolanda. Oh my gosh, well, I'm not gonna be able to sell this. I mean, unless somebody's name's Yolanda. This is personalized, so I did look this up. These are like, you know, about $24.99, but you're supposed to get them personalized. So I didn't know this one was going to come personalized. So that's funny. I don't really know what I'm going to do with that. I mean, I guess I can list it. And if somebody's looking for a bag with Leolanda, but other than that, uh, here we got some pure white Christmas lights. Oh my gosh, here's another bag. I didn't know there was two of them, you guys. We're going to have to open it up. Let's see whose name's on it. Maybe it's yours. Here we go. Dun, 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 dun. Whose name? Preston. Preston is the winner. I got two bags, Preston and Yolanda. <laughs> so they're like Christmas bags. So must be they, got, they didn't like them and sent them back after they already got them personalized. All right, so here is a bag. This is another curtain. Um, it does have the box. It's two panels um, from the, what is it called? Stratford Park Home Collection. Um, they're the pom-pom curtains. So um, probably not too much value in these. I mean, there's a nail. What the heck is the nail for? I don't even understand what the board is for. Huh, interesting. So, Stratford Park. Hmm. 
right there. Yeah, so these had a just a value of about $20. So I'm not sure about those. And then last thing is the UGG curtain. That's another reason why I got the box, because the UGG brand, the UGG, like the one curtain, I think the box is in here. I guess they probably just couldn't figure out how to fit it in there. So, um, you know, it is new. Um, and it's a blackout curtain. So it's a room darkening gourmet window panel, 50 by 84. So, you know, they do have the box. Um, probably gonna, I, I believe it said it was valued at $50. So let's check it out. Ugh, oatmeal, $49.99. So I don't know, I have to look this up and see, but that's another thing. But I don't know, what do you guys think? I mean, I only paid the $87 for it. I mean, it kind of stinks about these bags. I don't even know what to do with these. The Yolanda and the Preston bags, like, so I, I, I can, I, I don't know. I have to see if I can make my money back or not. Um, I don't know because I can't, I can't sell the candle. Um, I can't sell these bags. Like I could sell this, but I kind of want to keep it, you know? Um, I can sell the steak knife. I can sell the, the clock. Um, and these, these curtains, I can sell all the curtains just new, just with no, um, no box. So we'll have to see. Um, I'm going to see what I can do and I'll tell you, I'll get back to you guys, let you guys know what I list things for. And I'll be tuning in later this week or this weekend to let you guys know how I've been doing on my other boxes. So thanks for coming to my channel. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. I appreciate the subscribers and like this video. Have a great day.